Hello dear friends, welcome to Casa Naturals. In today's video, I'm going to share with you how to formulate deep conditioner for healthy and hydrated hair. Make sure that you watch this video until to the end. So, of course, uh, I had done uh, hydrolyzed protein last month. So, my goal is to make sure that my hair is moisturized. So, all the ingredients that we're going to use are for moisturizing our hair. So, we are going to start with some neem and uh, moringa. So moringa contains high content of vitamin A that's supporting hair growth and um, neem promotes hair growth. It will soothe the hair, it will minimize grace, it will reduce dandruff and it will treat head lice. So of course uh, I'm using dry leaves and you can actually buy but I just made my own because I've got uh, a number of them at home or rather trees. Yeah, so that is how they look like. So we are going to work, uh, make sure that our water phase is so fancy. It has ingredients that actually promote hair growth. So you can actually uh, alternate between different kinds of herbs, but I just thought that I can go with these products or rather herbs. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put them in a beaker and then I'm going to add some hot water. So when I say hot water, friends, it's 100% hot. We're not going to put it on heat. So if you are new on my channel, you can click on that red subscribe button and subscribe today. So if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much, dear friends, for your love and your support. So on this channel, I do share videos every day on classic lifestyle, healthy lifestyle, how to have flawless skin, how to grow closer to God, and how to make your own DIY, and how to take care of your beautiful natural hair. So we are going to let it uh, simmer in the water for at least uh, 15 to 20 minutes. So we are giving it a stir so that it can be well infused. As you can see, like it has started combining very well. So this is what we want to go for to make sure that our water phase is so rich. Yeah, so we are going to put that aside and then we'll start working on the other products. So as you can see, it has already started infusing. So we are going to... Um, put it aside and um, uh, until it is infused. So it's been actually 20 minutes. It has infused well, as you can see, friends, and the color has changed. So at this point, we are going to strain it. Make sure that uh, you get a fine strainer. But of course, since our leaves, they are not fine, you can actually get away with uh, a bigger uh, whole strain. So we are going, also going to use our emulsifier which is actually the high quad. So it will work as an emulsifier. It, improve, it will improve weight and dry compatibility and repair damaged hair. And it is actually used as a primary emulsifier and it has the stability to complex formulas. And it will also bring our products together so that it doesn't separate. We are also going to use some uh, herbal hair growth blend. So there is a lot of oils like neem, uh, peppermint, uh, moringa, a lot of them so i'll link the videos in the description below how you can make them so oil will actually lubricate and it will make hair more elastic thus preventing breakage we are also going to use our honey so honey is a humectant it will actually restore moisture to your hair and um, it has moisturizing properties to help keep your hair soft conditioned and it will also contain plenty of minerals amino acids and antioxidants and honey has a lot of uh, as emollients which smooth the hair follicles and adding shine to your hair we are also going to use some aloe vera so aloe vera contains a lot of moisturizing benefits and it's rich in vitamin a c which will keep your hair strands healthy it contains an inflammatory benefits that aids to smooth uh, uh, to soothe and each scalp so comment in the section below friends and give this video a like we're also going to use some sobito so Sobito will help to condition your hair, making it soft, smooth, and tangle-free. So Sobito acts as a plasticizer, plasticizer in uh, many hair care products, thereby adding elastic to hair and increasing its tensile strength also prevents your hair from drying out. So we are adding our oil face. So I've added some uh, the high quartz. We are also going to use some uh, to add some oil. As you can see friends so subscribe to our channel if you haven't give this video a like and comment in the section below and we're also going to use our honey yes so that is our all phase so th that is actually um phase b since we have already done our f phase which is um water phase 
so friends like uh, i love formulating very much so we are also going to use we are also going to add in some um sobito so the deep conditioning was very moisturizing friends so that is our phase uh, b so we are done now adding all phase a phase b ingredients in our beaker and we are going to actually add the two beakers we're going to put them in hot water on heat so these are the two phases and then for phase c i'm going to show you exactly what we added to phase c to make it more moisturizing so after putting on heat wait until it melts like you see that your all your ingredients will melt and the water phase will actually be heated this is very very important friends so that there isn't any separation so once we've we've actually removed from the heat and we are adding a uh, phase a into phase b as you can see it's coming up well so actually we are making a 500 batch of uh, moisturizing deep conditioner so we want our hair to be soft and manageable so all these ingredients that i've added actually promotes man manageable soft hair which will actually prevent damage and your hair will keep on um growing friends so blend 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 so as you have seen like it has started thickening up yes i'm loving how it coming out friends so you can even um use it as a leave-in conditioner but you know what if you want to make for selling you ha don't have to go with uh, um raw honey make sure that you replace it with um, another ingredient so it has actually started thickening up as you can see look at that friends we are super excited so don't worry about the formula i'm going to link it in the description box below so now we are adding our aloe vera in the coffers and we're also going to add our preservative yes like um all these ingredients they are very very moisturizing for your hair and they'll make your hair keep on growing so at this point we are going to add in our preservative this is very important so that we prevent, we prevent any microbials entering your final product this is very very important so this is the uxc 7k12 preservative that i use so i'm adding in our preservative so comment in the section below friends i would love to hear from you if you're enjoying this video give this video a thumbs up so i'm going to use the spatula just mixing and then i'll go in with our immersion blender so have you seen like it's rich and it's soft but of course at this point it, it looks so watery because it's hot once it's it uh, cools it will actually start thickening up so that is how it looks like so i'm going to wait until it cools so it has um cooled and we have gotten our bottles we are putting it in our jars and at this point actually you can add a colorant but i didn't want to add any colorant we're going to go with all natural colors so i like that creamy color from the um oils yes it wasn't white but it, it was some kind of a creamy 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 white so that is our final product subscribe to our channel comment in the section below and give this video a like so we are super excited because our deep conditioner moisturizing deep conditioner is ready at this point so i'm going to use it on my hair so friends like i alternate between moisturizing and protein conditioner so last time i'd use a protein conditioner now it's time to use our uh, moisturizing deep conditioner so i'm starting off on freshly washed hair i had actually done a pre pull washed and then it's now time to apply our conditioner so like this conditioner is thick as you can see i love thick deep conditioners so like it came out very nice friends so make sure that you apply it to every strand of your hair and make sure that you avoid the scalp because you don't, you don't want to clog your pores so like if i want to apply it on the roots i make sure that i apply it strategically without applying it on the scalp 
So once I'm done, I'm going to break that section, twist it, and then go to another section. So I always work in sections. This helps so that every hair strand could be coated with whatever product you are using. So comment in the section below, friends. I would love to hear from you. And uh, of course, I'm going to share with you, I'm going to share with you the result, the outcome on how this deep conditioner actually worked. So make sure that you continue watching this video until to the end. And I really appreciate you know, guys for your love and your support, for your beautiful comments. Keep them coming, friends. I really appreciate you. Yes. So if you're watching my video and you haven't yet subscribed to our channel, make sure that you click the subscribe button and subscribe now. So to all my subscribers, I thank you so much, dear friends. So if you have any suggestion for this channel, you can actually comment in the section below and I'll be glad to hear from you. So this deep conditioner actually was, can actually detangle your hair, friends, like uh, all the shady hair was coming out. So I deep condition my hair every two weeks. So depending on uh, what I want to achieve, if I'm in a protective hairstyle, then I deep condition, deep condition once per, per month. So I've gotten back, if I'm not in a protective hairstyle, if I'm doing low manipulation hairstyles, like which lasts for every two weeks, that's when I'll deep condition my hair. So usually my routine is every two weeks. But in between washes, I do moisturize my hair. So comment in the section below how often you deep condition your hair. So you don't have like to overdo deep conditioning, like deep conditioning every day. You have to deep condition at least, you know, once uh, per week, every two weeks, or every three weeks, or once per month, depending on your preference. But what I've noted is that every two weeks actually works well for my hair. Like, I see a difference when I'm doing every two weeks. But once I deep condition once per month, it doesn't, it, it my hair, like, feels dry and um, it doesn't feel okay, you know. But once I start doing every two weeks, my hair thrives. So I think I'll get back to my original routine. I'll be putting in a protective hairstyle that can last actually for two weeks. What matters is you are not manipulating your hair, friends. Like don't touch your hair like every day. That's manipulation. If you touch your hair every day, it means that you are manipulating your hair. So make sure that you protect your hair so that you don't manipulate it. If you're trying to grow out your hair, make sure that... Uh, you avoid, you know, manipulating your hair. So we are almost done. Like this deep moisturizing treatment did work well very much. And I'm happy, you know. Yes. So at this point, we are done. So today I did really coat every strand well. So usually I go in when I feel that I haven't coated if I miss some other places. So that is how much is left. Like we still have a lot. Yes, so this will actually last for at least two months. So at this point, I'm going to sit under a bonnet hair dryer. So this is very, very important so that the products can actually penetrate. So I'm putting on a plastic bag. You can even put it on a shower cup, but I don't love shower cups because they don't really um, uh, secure well. The, yes, friends. So... I'm going to read, like I love reading, The Lost Art of Thinking. I love reading very much. If you've been long on this channel, like I love reading and I read every day. Yes. So continue watching, friends. I'm going to share with you the results at the end, like our hair was so, so, so moisturized. Yes. So, of course, I always share what I was reading. Uh, and today... Um, I don't think I'm, I'm going to do that. Yes, but uh, the book is to reach friends like it. So friends, I was reading the book, How to Improve Emotional Intelligence and uh, Achieve Peak Mental Performance. So I was reading on the subtopic, which says a workout for the brain. So exercise is extremely beneficial to the body and mind of young, old, healthy, and ailing people. So the physical results of consistent exercise translates into significant mental advantages as well as, as well. So it's especially uh, critical for individuals at risk for cognitive impairment. 
So at this point, we are done, friends. That is how our hair looks like. Like it's so soft and manageable, but of course, it has shrunken. But friends, I'm telling you, I'm happy. The hair is so soft. So thank you so much for watching this video, friends. And I appreciate you so, 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 so much. So look at that. Yes, so like there's a lot of shrinkage there. Yes. So we are done. I'm happy like this deep conditioner did work thank you so much god bless to see you in our next video